history rooted in the struggle of civil rights, which was started by Dr. Milana Karenga, a professor of black studies at Cal State Long Beach in 1966, following the Watts riots in LA as a way to bring the community together. Black culture is central to world culture and international culture. And we just enjoyed, you know, this day. It's a wonderful day. The two-mile route started in the Crenshaw District and ended at Lamert Park for a gathering of vendors, food, and music. In that area where we started, which is the Adams area, that was called the Blueberry Hill area. And coming up Crenshaw, the Crenshaw District is pretty much well, predominantly black, or it started out that way, and now we're a multicultural community. The ending here in Lamert Park is even more significant because that's where we all come together to celebrate our oneness. This is also an opportunity to remind the community about the week-long observance. This is your holiday. Make it be what you wish it to be. Make it be something great, grand, and wonderful. And expand, expand, expand. And learn. The event highlighting this year's theme, Kila Kitu Kwanzaa, meaning everything Kwanzaa, honoring two community members as the king and queen who stand out in their work to empower and bring people together. We are striving to be the best that we can in this world full of adults, of cultures that are, have been around for 2,000 years, but we're striving to make our image, make our imprint on this planet. Reporting from Lamarck Park, Trace Pinnock, NBC 4 News. Okay, get your umbrellas.